In this video, we're going to learn the functionality of rest time between sets. For that, we're going to start a training session. We select the athletes with which we want to train and any exercise we want. First, we go to settings and then to rest time, which is on the third row. If it is de deactivated, then we activate it and we're going to set it to one minute of rest time, for example. Okay, now let's imagine these three athletes are all on the same rack, and the first one up is Anthony, for example. He would start getting into position and start lifting. Okay, so he's done his reps, and when he hits end, his minute of rest starts. Now, let's imagine the next athlete comes up and does his set, same as the last one. He does several reps... And the moment he hits end, his rest time would start. And then lastly is Tony. Same. Does his reps. And when he's ready, or when he's done, rather, he would hit end. And now we can see that Anthony's minute of rest is still not over, and the app will warn him when he starts, when the minute is almost up, so we can start preparing. So we wait. Anthony Bishop. There it is. Okay, it said his name. So he can start getting ready. Okay, so the athlete would be getting ready while the app is beeping. He would then select his profile and start lifting again. He starts lifting again. Okay, now, we see that Josh, Josh's rest time is up. When your rest time is up, it appears in red. Your profile appears in red, so we can tell more easily. Okay, now it would be his turn. He would hit start and start lifting. Whoever is in red is up. And then when we go back, Tony would be in red again. Now we see that Tony is in red. He would start lifting, and so on and so forth, and that would be everything.